Hi guys, so today we have some upcoming news for some upcoming Funko Pops here and there's a lot of Batman related stuff to celebrate Batman Day and new Stranger Things Black Lights Pops that will be coming over to Target so we'll be starting with with the Black Lights so Target, Target is releasing some new new Black Lights and they're in the the version of the, the show Stranger Things on Netflix and um, I don't really know much about Stranger Things or the Black Lights but I do know that which is interesting to know about Target is that they have not uh, they don't have good taste on the shippings for everybody because there's a lot of delays that be coming out for previous Black Lights but but we have some new black lights for, from Stranger Things here. Not just the pods, also merchandise is here. Alright, so first off for the Stranger Things black lights. We have some, not just the Funko Pop figures, but also some accessories included. Like, they have their pin sets. They also have a backpack of the black lights, which I'm surprised I had never seen it. And they also have like a box, with this, which includes a t-shirt. The box looks like it really is an arcade, an arcade machine which you guys go to arcades in. And all of this is just black lights. And the pots we have are Eleven, Dustin, and and the monster named Dim Mor, Dim Gorgon. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce the name. I'm not a stranger. I'm not a fan of Stranger Things. I never seen it. But they do look really really nice and if there's anything we need to know about black lights is that they're gonna be immediately sold out and online it's really really like a really rush hour to get black lights everywhere for fans. And I'm not really gonna get those. I'm not a fan of Stranger Things or the black lights. Okay, now for some Batman figures here. We have a lot of a lot of Batman Funkos here today to show you guys. And I gotta say, I mean it is the way to celebrate Batman Day. So first up we got here is some new art series Batman figures. And there are lots of three kinds. And by the way, these are Funko exclusives. Which meaning that along with there are a lot of like Batman stuff that are gonna be on Funko's shopup.com but uh, we have three sets of the Batman art series figures and I I'm not really much of a fan of Batman a lot um, I don't know much about DC or anything but I got to do say they look really really nice really cool indeed there's one thing I do which ones I like it's probably the Probably the blue one with the yellow Bat the yellow Batman logos on it. It's really really nice. Even though I'm not gonna go gonna get it, it's look it still looks nice. And the next one we have here is what looks like Batman Beyond. And he's not gonna come in just a Funko figure, he's also appearing in a soda, Funko Soda. And I remember the first, so we have the Batman Beyond figure that's, like I said, the Funko exclusive. And I do remember watching only a little bit of Batman Beyond when I was like little. And I remember seeing him appearing on a show called Death Battle. And I do got to say, I do like the way that his position looks like. He looks really, really nice. Really cool. It really brings back so much memories because like because like we you i remember like watching like batman beyond only a little bit and it was it brings back so much memories of it i i might be able to get this figure if this if they're going to be still available which means i gotta get my rush to it but we also have some so a batman beyond soda figure and they're there's two variants. We have the regular one, and we also have a 
chase one, which looks like he might be glow in the dark with the red veins. Because, I mean, this is an, a futuristic back suit. And they look really, really nice. Really cool indeed. And next up is you guys do remember the seeing the die cast Captain America figure for the Summer Funcon 2021 thing, right? Well, now it's Batman's turn and he's getting his own die cast, which is also Funko exclusive. And this is the Batman from 1989. And I do gotta say, I feel like these diecast figures might be the new thing that will be coming out very, very, really soon. So like, first up, there was Captain America. Now, we also have Batman. Really nice. Really, really cool. It's like, it really, it really does look like like the box where all the Funkos goes in are really translucent. I really love it very much. Again, I might not be able to get this one, but it still looks cool for all Batman fans out there. Next up, we also have the Joker King, which is, you guessed it, the Batman, the Funko exclusive. And I don't know much about the Joker. I do remember seeing him in like Mortal Kombat 11 with my brother. But I do gotta say though, this one, the Joker King, he looks really menacing. So scary indeed. I mean like, I mean like, he looks really really nice. He got like the... He's got many kind of, different kinds of face features around his body. I mean his head. And like his hair, really spunk, really punk-like. So, so so really awesome and like there's a, i mean i really wish there would be like more jokers out there that would be look like this but i mean like i don't like i said i don't know much about dc or anything i'm more a little bit more of a marvel fan but i still got to say he looks really really menacing and really 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 so graphical and we're still into the last set of Batman figures here. These ones are GameStop exclusives and EB Games exclusives. Whichever countries you're in. But uh, we have a lot of the sets. A box that will be filled in with Batman stuff called the Deceased. And inside it there will be like 1 in 4 chances to get a lot of the one of these figure. These accessories like 1 in 4 of the Funko Pops of Batman and Joker. One where one of each is regular and while one of each is like covered in blood. One in four chances of a pop key of a pop key chain, which is like the same thing as the figurines. And the same thing goes for like the Funko size pins. And there'll be also like stickers and like stickers and it looks really, really like graphical. I gotta tell you. Like seriously, the bloods on a little bit different Batman and Joker. It looks really touched on. I feel like it would have been much better if like the the bloody one, the bloody Batman and Joker ones, might be might be a Chase exclusive. If it would be a better choice, but I do gotta say it looks. But, you know, it's really, really, really cool indeed. What a way to celebrate Batman's year. Like, the keychains, the Funko size pins, the figurines and stickers a lot. Really, really a way to celebrate the Bat. And that is all we have today for today's news. With more black lights coming over to Target and all things Batman related to celebrate Batman Day. And I know this is not a important qu question to ask you, but my hair looks like it's a little wet. Just because I just I just got back from checking outside because it was raining a lot, and I'm gonna show you guys how how badly it rained. Like, look, look at this. 
Good thing it's all cleared up for now. And well, anyways, that's it for today. We have for the news today. And if you guys liked it, why not? Why don't you leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more upcoming news and more upcoming Funko unboxing? Which, by the way, I'm going to do the unboxings monthly. Like next week, I mean next month, will be me unboxing a new box of Funko Pops. And news, I'll be able to show you guys, tell you a lot more. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, like, comment, and subscribe. And share this video for more videos coming soon. I'll see you guys later.